My name is Amani Ode. I am a dentist from Silwan, a neighborhood in Jerusalem, a mother of two children, Adam and Silwan. Silwan is a neighborhood near to the old city of Jerusalem. We have 13 neighborhoods uh, inside Silwan. Six of those neighborhoods have demolishing orders or evictions orders. What's the story? The story of uh, Al Bustan neighborhood uh, starts in 2005 when the municipality came with demolishing orders for the 100 houses inside Al Bustan neighborhood. All of them have demolishing orders because the municipality claimed that there is uh, no permission for those houses to be built in this area. Al Bustan neighborhood is one of the neighborhoods in Silwan which is facing demolishing orders for the whole neighborhood. They give us a, a demolishing order for uh, our house and they give us 20 days in order to do what is called self-demolishing. Of course, in Al Bustan neighborhood, we refuse to do any self-demolishing because we, we are doing a whole plan for the whole neighborhood. But till now, the municipality refused uh, any plan that we sent for them. They refused till now six plans given by the engineering uh, committee that we have in Al Bustan neighborhood. They claim that the, the problem that we don't have permissions for our house. But one time they told us it's not about permissions, it's politics. We, uh, we are going to take those lands and we will refuse any plan you give uh, for us as a municipality because we know that we, we want this land uh, of Silman. Jerusalem till now is an occupied area. It shouldn't be under Israeli law. So for us, we know that even those laws that come and say that we have no permission to build or no permission to stay at Jerusalem, it's just a, a fake laws. In Jerusalem, each neighborhood, Silwan, Sheikh Jarrah, Al Asawiya, Tour, have the same scenario. You will hear the same story from different people. You will always hear about demolishing orders or eviction orders, the same stories, the same ideas, in order to change the majority, Arabic Palestinian majority who live in these areas, into settlements and settlers. Every day I have this feeling that when I go to work that I am leaving my my everything, my kids in the house, especially now in the, in the summer holidays. I leave my children in the house, which is supposed to be the, the most safe place that I can imagine. But for me, it's, it, it may be the, the most dangerous area at one moment because they can come when I am far away when they, their dad is at war and demolish the house while my children inside it. My children uh, once uh, took uh, their toys in their bags to school and uh, when I, I see it in the, in the bags, I ask them, why you are taking your toys to school? And Silvan tell me that Adam told her uh, that uh, she, she should have uh, her toys because if they come and they were destroying the house, they will lose everything. Last year, they come and demolished a butcher shop here in Silvan. It's beside us. Uh, so they uh, wake uh, up at the morning and they see the police members and the soldiers around our house and closing the streets in order for the people not to go to the butcher shop to stand with them. And I was filming with my phone and the soldier come and told us to stop filming what is happening. So I was with Adam and he was uh, very afraid but I, I have to, to move and to film what is happening because they were using violence against the people who were 
standing on the streets. So I asked Adam to, to take the camera, the other camera, and he was filming and crying. And I started to, to be stressed at that time because I imagined that they come for our house and uh, demolished it. Silwan, Silwan, my daughter, and Silwan, my land, and Silwan, my beloved place where I was born and raised. Before a year of uh, her uh, birth, uh, I was arrested. Uh, they come and arrested me from the house at the night. I feel that I am losing Adam, and I am losing my right to be in Silwan. Uh, so at that night, I think that if I have a daughter, I will call her Silwan in order, if I lose the land, she will uh, hold her name in order to, to continue what I began.